All right, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to Blood on the Clock Tower Day. We've got Big Keith on the left and Little Keith in the middle. Um, this is a new layout I'm trying out because it's a bit silly, but look, you don't really need to be seeing me in the actual camera that much, so I might as well sit on the screen. But this time we are running Fighting the Fog. This is a script I've been working on for a little while. Uh, it has a whole bunch of homebrew characters. It's about 30%. Um, and the goal is to create something at the difficulty level of Sex and Violence. So if you are interested in having a look at what characters are on the script, pause the video now. And then pause the video now to see the second half. Because I'm not going to go through them all individually. I've already explained it to all of our players. Uh, but it is time to set up. So we have played the Maestro before and it was very fun. I, yeah, also while we are on this screen, my green screen goes away. So you can deal with not seeing my pretty face for a moment. Um, I think we go spy. We're supposed to have two by default because it is nine. Actually, let's go Atlus. Um, which means we're going to have eight townsfolk, which I think is fine. That's magician atlas doesn't quite work. <laughs> Psionic is kind of funny. Chef will get a zero. Um, balloonist and atlas is really rough because the balloonist will always just learn the person that they selected. Um, let's get several village idiots and then I need one more thing. I don't really want to do the dreamer because that could be game over. Let's go Shrine Maiden. Shrine Maiden, Show, Yagababble and Fanku. Is that good? Shigenja is kind of backbreaking here. Maybe we go Town Crier. So the lunatic <laughs> thinks that they are a demon. They don't specifically think that they are an evil demon. So I could try and convince them that they've been pit hagged into a good demon. That's kind of funny. Okay, well, let's pass out our characters and see how this goes. That scenario, you right, need to actually go and wake up. Also, you have to you have to choose another player, and that's all you can do really like you choose someone closest to the demon yeah uh, all right everyone i am all ready to get started so get your sleeping cap on because it's time to enter the first night go to sleep okay full mute there now i think my night sheet might be a little cooked i'm unsure um but I'll just kind of run through everything. Ah, oh, you got here like five seconds too late. Okay. Um, let's add a seat. Add a seat. And we're going to have a traveler. Yeah, we're going to have a traveler um, who is going to be. I think the gunslinger is maybe a bit brutal. Let's just go apprentice for now. Five evil players. Uh, what's up, everyone? We've had a traveler join. This is right before anything has happened in the setup of the game. Um, so Justin will be your apprentice. They will be considered in the game for any and all information abilities that happen on the first night and all of that kind of stuff. So, all right, go back to sleep. Um, okay. So I want to figure out who our apprentice is going to be. Um, and it can duplicate an in-play character, which is kind of swag. I also could create a minion for the apprentice to throw off. Mm, is that rude? Is that maybe mean? Um, 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 um. No, I want to test Atlas, like actually see it do good. So maybe I'll go Monk. Yeah, let's go Monk. I'll look them up and tell them that they are the Monk. 
Hello. Hello. On the camera's not working. It's all good. Yeah, it's hello. You got here like five seconds too late. Um, yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, you it's are right. a princess, and you have the yep. monk ability. Monk ability. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, do I get to pick? Uh, on the first night, you will not be protecting anyone. Oh, yes, yeah, that's right, yeah. That's right. So okay, cool. I'll, I'll come back and pester you later, don't worry. Yep. Yeah. What a dub. Okay. Um, cool, let's go back to our night sheet. So we have our monk. I think this is fine, honestly. Um, we don't have any of these setups. We have our demon minion info. Um, so he's gonna know magicians don't play. So I basically just give him like every other character. Shugenja. Um, Hello. Hello. Uh, welcome to town, Atlas. Uh, the entire team rests upon your shoulders. Um, you have no teammates, mm -hmm. but your bluffs are Balloonist, Shrine mm -hmm. Maiden, Shugenja. Balloonist. So what was the second one? Shrine, Shrine Maiden. Shrine Maiden and Shugenja. Shugenja. Thank you. All good. Best of luck. I've been a minion in a magician game and okay we don't have an imitator to set up we have a chef and the chef is going to receive a zero if our, if our chef would please wake up Hello, sorry, the, Hello. the sound didn't come up. It's okay. Uh, you are our chef, and you learn that there are zero pairs of evil players. I see. I'm a balloonist, and I got Rick. Sounds great. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, then we get into our village idiots. I'm going to have our psionic. Just have a quick look. This is an asterisk. This is not on the first night this is an asterisk msc is towards the end uh, so we're going to do our village idiots starting from midnight hello hey hey uh please select a player i will choose alan alan you learn alan is good thank you all right best of luck one of the 100 yeah it's 250 yes um because there's a couple games that i wanted to hello oh hello please select a player this feels very familiar um <laughs> oh it just has to be rick doesn't it okay uh you select rick and you learn that rick is evil oh no <laughs> ah it's deja really vu isn't it <laughs> i really didn't want to get him executed because I feel bad at this point. Every game. Every game. Every game. Yeah. I have to do it now. All right. All right, good luck. <laughs> not my fault, Rick. <laughs> that was my goal for Clock Tower Con, which I didn't meet, so. Yeah. But having um, Ben Burns was really good. But I think it'd be interesting to have, like, a... Hello. Okay. Uh, please I'll choose a player. Justin. 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 Excellent. You learn that Justin is good. Thank you. Best of luck. That was quite a good game. Quite oh. a good game. Hello. Uh, Hello. Welcome, Psionic. Are you? Do you understand how your character works? Did you want me to walk through it for you? No, I think I'm good. Um, <clears throat> I'm treating this as a shot in the dark, right? Like there's Pretty much. no. That's the whole idea. Yeah. That means I've understood it then. Okay. Uh, well, my plan is to start with Weedy okay. as a townsfolk and okay. go anti-clockwise through to Justin. So Weedy as townsfolk, Alan okay. as outsider, Rollo yep. as minion, yep. Justin as demon. Okay. You got a one. Okay. I will take that. Cool. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Might as well try and do those. Yeah. I, I... Okay. Quick double check. Chef has their info. 
Village idiots are all activated. Monk doesn't need to protect anyone. Atlas does not kill anybody yet. Um, this is not activated. This is everything. Let's wake everybody up. Was Good morning, everybody. You awake to discover me, your favorite storyteller of all time, has died. My body has been whisked away into the fog inexplicably. And the only thing that could explicably it is that it's a demon. A demon must have killed me. Please avenge me. You will have five minutes for the first day. Uh, just to clarify as well, Justin is the apprentice, right? That's correct. When you give yeah. the apprentice an ability, they're no longer a traveler with the setup thing. Yeah. All good. Um, who wants the bluffs? Sure. Oh, you're good. And I'm the sober one. This okay. is good info. Okay. Um, you don't have to tell me I'm... what you are, but I'm going to lie to everyone else. That's fine. I was planning on hard claiming to you as well anyway, or the first person to talk to me. I'm also a VI. Oh, um, okay. I picked Rick, and you <laughs> guess what I got? <laughs> you got evil, didn't you? I did. Okay, fair enough. At this point, I don't want to push on it, because I feel bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, well, I can pick him. Oh, I don't know. I, know. I don't really know what the meta thing is about yeah. doubling up picks. I mean, if you got me and got good... If, I mean, if you're telling the truth, it makes yeah. me think that you are... Um... The drunk one or the non-drunk one? Well, I couldn't know enough yet. Okay. Um, but I have no reason to believe that I'm the drunk just yet. Okay. I've got no info, so, yeah. Mm. Okay. You've got no to... info? Well, I got, I got info, but I don't know if it's <laughs> good or bad. Um, did you... Um, do you want to synchronise who we check, or...? Um, I'm not sure that's helpful, really. Okay. Um, no, no, you would learn that. If I keep your hand. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, yes. Are you going to play, like, just as a townsfolk then? Since you're... Yeah, because I am a townsfolk. Yeah, I'm essentially. Yeah. Okay, cool. Do you want to do, like, a two or three? Um, yeah, we can do two. Okay, cool. Um, I can give you either Shrine Maiden or oh. either Cannibal. Shrine Maiden or what? Oh, Cannibal. Yeah. How I'll you give think? you a Village Idiot or a Town Cryer. Interesting. Okay. I'm a Dreamer and I've confirmed the person I've spoken to. Okay, cool. Um... I'm probably not going to tell anyone else that there's a sh that I'm the chef today. I'll just go tell people other random shit. Do you, um, mind, do you mind if I claim Chef Zero? Yeah, cool. I, it's good to share that info out. Um, yeah, keep people from thinking they're marionettes. Yeah, um, I've heard of a, a monk, so I might try and slyly met, let them know that you're worth saving. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Oh, sounds good. All right, thank you. Thank you. Uh, misinformation all around the world. Okay, fair enough. I have heard one of the claim of VI, but it was in th I've, in a two. So I've heard of a uh, hard claim as well. So I've got I've got one as well. Okay, so that's including you. That's three then. Yeah, if those are if they're all if, if they're, they're all, all legit. Okay, yeah. fair enough. Okay, catch up. Catch up. Time prior or the chef. Okay, I'm either the village idiot, the chef. Or Shikendran. Okay, awesome. Okay, cool. Thank you. Okay, Keith. Sorry, I've completely forgot what you told me about Justin. Was he good or evil? You learned that Justin was good. Thank you. That's interesting, because I am the chef. You're the chef. I'm the chef. Well, that's problematic. There can only be one chef. You know, there's you, there's that saying, too many cooks in the kitchen. Exactly. Exactly. Right. That's, well, that's okay. You could be my imitator. That's interesting. Actually, imitator is basically just outside of Pixie. I like that. Um. Well, what you... is your chef number? Uh, I'm going to keep that to myself for the moment. Okay. Well, um, what's your chef number? Uh, I got a chef one. So classic marionette worlds up in here. Okay, interesting. All right. Well, um, 
Yeah, I guess we'll. I'll, I'll see you in town square, and we can. Ooh, I've heard a lot of chefs. Um, okay. Balloonist, town crier, or chef. Cool. Um, while Keith's here, I will ask for a story for the consult just so that he hears it. Um, but yeah, I'll give you a uh, balloonist, shrine maiden, or shugenja. Interesting. I feel like yeah. uh, one of those is more likely to need a consult than the others, but I'll leave you to it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Yeah. Keith, do you want to stick around? Uh, sure. I had a question. If I chose to turn someone who was a village idiot and they were uh, the sober one, for example, would the other one, would another village idiot inherit the soberness after I turned them? Uh, only if you removed the drunk one from play would a sober one become a drunk one. If you removed a sober one, there would still be one village idiot and then one drunk village idiot, which fulfills the one of the extras as drunk requirement. So only if you remove the drunk oh, one, okay. would I adjust so that that requirement is still fulfilled. It makes sense. All right, cool. Thanks. Catch you. Hi, Hi. welcome back, everybody. It oh. is time for nominations and executions. Ellen, Ellen, I'm waiting for you to do something. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm nominating Rick. Let's, think <laughs> Let's get it out of the way. It's tradition. <laughs> Alan, please tell us why this time we should kill Rick. Um, I really hate it, but I have heard of an evil thing on Rick, and I'm not even lying. <laughs> but we don't have to do it. It's fine. Uh, Rick, we do, Alan. We have to do we it. Kind of do. We mean... kind of do. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've got nothing more to say. Okay, uh, five votes are required. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start the countdown. This doesn't look sus at all, like all the hands around Alan. Yeah, it's, a lot it's of fine, there's no typhoon gameplay. On the <laughs> <laughs> oh, one more, one more. Yeah! Wait, let me all check right. my message. That Alan didn't is tell me I was enough. marrying that or anything. Rick has volunteered and is slated with five votes. Any further nominations? Um, I'll nominate Emilio. Um, we usually do this thing where we hard time each other on day one. Um, I think today we should kill Emilio instead, though, <laughs> because I got sus vibes. Okay, Emilio, any notes? The classic. Um, yeah, look, this is this is fine. I'm fine to die. Okay. Especially if we want to rule out sus fives. Uh, five that to tie, six to die, spinning it down, starting now. I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm Emilia's marionette. I'm going to do it. Clock's good wonky. cannibal food, Emilia? Alright, six is enough, and Emilia is now slated for execution. Any final nominations? Um, yeah, probably. I haven't heard of one, but if there is, I am. Uh, Hello Weedy uh, nominates Rollo. All right. Hello Wicked, tell us why we should kill Rollo. Uh, two reasons. One, Rollo is in a double claim. Uh, a hint for the role is that there's too many cooks in the kitchen. Oh. And the second reason is. is that Either of us could be Alan's marionette, and so we need to work out who the one true marionette is. Yes. I have it on good authority that uh, I'm the marionette, so can you leave me alive until the final okay. day so I can um, win sense. with Alan? <laughs> okay. All right. To Six to tie, seven to die. Spinning it down. Any Starting consolation, Weedy? Now. I did lie to you. I just wanted to see your reaction. <laughs> Worthy of a vote. Can confirm Roller did lie to me. That is not enough. I'll be closing in 10. Are you allowed to lie to people in this game? I don't think so. Let me check. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Doesn't say the rules, does it? Oh, sorry, oh, guys. All right. Amelia has oh, been Roller. executed. Everybody, please go to sleep. Oh, good. Okay, let's go to our other nights. 
Excellent. Okay, first up is our monk. Uh, I think this is fine. Just making sure my night sheet is correct. Because uh, I didn't double check it before we ran, but I think it is fine. We're going to see our monk first. Uh, we are also going to be adding our new traveler. Uh, um, gather players, add seat. Over here, can I? Do I just have to click on it? How do I move? How do I move the seat? How do I move das seat? I didn't really want them all next to each other, but okay. Um, hello, town. We have a another traveler joining us. Welcome to the beaten path. Um, Paul has joined us, and Paul will be. Um, a character of my choosing very shortly. Uh, okay. Like, is it the harlot? One minute despite Justin. Okay. Uh, that's correct. Justin does not interact with the the game setup. It's still a nine player default. Okay. Uh, so just to reiterate, Paul has joined us, and Paul is the harlot. That's a cool. Hello. Hey. Uh, you are our evil harlot. Okay. Um, cool. And in that, you learn that Nathan is the demon. Okay. All right. And that's it. Good luck. Cool. Thanks. Going into a dog show. Okay. So we've done this setup. We now need to do the monk to select a player. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. I will protect Kate. Okay, um, which is over here. Excellent. Cool. Excellent. Thank you. Okay, I need to remember to activate the cannibal as the psionic, because they have the psionic ability, but they have not shown up on the night sheet. So I'm just gonna add a... I wish there was a does something tonight <laughs> reminder token. Uh, we've got our monk protected now. The monk says they are safe from the demon, uh, which means that Atlas cannot change their character type. All right, hello. No. First, please select somebody to die. Um, let's go with Rollo. Rollo, excellent. Yeah. Uh, dead. Cool. Now, please select somebody to change character type into either an outsider or a minion. Please change Alex into an outsider. Alex, time. Okay, into an outsider. Excellent. Uh, I will fiddle with that momentarily. Okay, cool. Um, that's it. Good job. <laughs> the grouchy couple in the building. Okay, we now have Alex has been turned into an outsider. I could just make them a drunk if I wished, but I'm going to make them the lunatic. And part of being the lunatic is that I need to do anything that I can to convince them that they are a demon. So I'm going to inform Alex that they have been pit-hagged into a good demon. And if they respond, come on. Hello. Hi, sorry. You have been selected by the pit-hag. No. <laughs> you have been turned into the good Yagababble. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, um, it's fun. So now your Yagababble phrase uh, is going to be, please nominate me. Oh, my God. <laughs> it should be, I'm the Yagababble. <laughs> You can just come out as the Agababble if you want. Whatever you want to do. So, so it's 
Please nominate me. Oh, I didn't say that. It's only during the day I have to do public food. Yeah. Okay. Um, so how does... Can I theoretically kill either people with this? Possibly, but I will be choosing who will die. So okay. it has to be a balanced game. It won't win the game. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to die eventually. Okay. Thank you. That's really funny. <laughs> All right, there you go. Um, have fun with that. Wait. What, there'll be Doom Death the Arbitry, right? That's correct. Oh, okay. So I'm just going to die. <laughs> you might. Hi, kids. I feel like by... All right, that's possibly the funniest thing I've ever done. Um, let's let's see how that plays out and get my night sheet back open. So we've resolved our Atlas ability. MSC is not going to do anything just yet because it is not the night before the final day. Our Tyon Cryer is going to learn a no. So let's do that. Hello. Hello. You are our Town Cryer. And yeah. you learn no minions nominated today. Uh, see, why did you say you are our town crier? Because now I think that means I'm the drunk. I'm just reiterating it for the video so people know what's going on if they're only listening. <sighs> okay. Uh, so no minions nominated. <laughs> no minions nominated. That's fair. Uh, I've um, been too mean to Kate in the past, apparently. Um, okay, let's do our village idiots, starting with Alan. Bored with being gaslit. Hello. Hello. Could you please select a player for me? Yeah, let's just pick Rollo. Picking Rollo, you learn that Rollo is evil. Mm, what a surprise. Hey, look, yeah. last time it was a Maestro game and the village idiot picked four evil players. Oh. And <laughs> so who knows? Maybe we'll have a repeat. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, anyway, um, good luck. <laughs> general confusion. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. I would like to choose Nathan, please. Nathan. Nathan, you learn that Nathan is evil. Okay. Thank you, Kate. Best of luck. Long. Okay, double check. I don't think I've missed anything. This is not supposed to activate. We did this already. Psionic is dead. Monk did activate. VI is dead. Everything seems correct. Let's wake him up. Pretty destroyed heart. Good morning, Basically. everybody. You all awake to discover Rollo has died. Uh, you will have Roll four up. minutes for today. Um, Very nice. I just got hagged into the good Yaga Um So, I need to wow. I was the cannibal. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, I'm not the cannibal. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're probably the lunatic. I, I just got p hagged there. I can't be the lunatic. Oh, so you oh. hagged into the lunatic, you would learn Yaga Babble. You can't oh, eat it would. Say you can't it's, think it, of good for the lunatic. If if you were pit agged into a if you actually pit agged into the Yagababel, I imagine there would have been two deaths because of the arbitrary deaths of yeah, the demon. I agree. That you should say the word like multiple times just to <laughs> yeah, what's, the, what's the word? I'm gonna do it once. Okay, what's the word? Please nominate me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, bye. Wait, so how can All a lunatic right. Think they've been pit hacked? Um, so I think I'm in. They get game. told they, yeah. Yeah. Um. But would they get a real character on day one? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. They got pit hacked yeah. last night. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> so. My death was for nothing. I know. <laughs> well, I was gonna t actually. I'll still talk to you, Amelia, if you're free. Oh, right, so it it is what it is. Oh well. Sorry, you're not the uh, not a minion today, are you? No, I'm not a minion. Did you? Uh, um, uh, I'm concerned you might be evil, Paul, just for reasons that I I've heard. Okay. Is that would that be? Is there any chance that might be true, Paul? No, no, no. no. I'm a good um, harlot. 
and I'm just Good looking heart. for people to sleep with um, to okay. find out their character. So, okay. what do you think you're a good pilot uh, person to confirm? Maybe tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. I, I could... I could uh... Night. Deaths haven't changed. Or you're the Fangu. I think I'm probably drunk. But also, Rick put himself on the block. So unless he... Yeah. Uh, he could be sober. Or he could not be the village idiot. I think Alan's just died. <laughs> I don't think he knows. Is Rick claiming village idiot? You're cutting out for me. I'm not sure if it's me or you, Alan. It's probably me. Uh, sorry, yeah, Rick claimed Village Idiot, hard claim. Or it's just a bit hacking. Um, yeah, just a bit hacking. I um, got really excited about being in front of her, and I... <laughs> I was a psionic. A psionic? Really? Ooh, it, this oh, is good. Oh, that would have been really fun. It would have been good. It would have been super helpful. Damn, Wait, is you... that kind of like a juggle, or how does it work? Yeah, it's a little bit like a juggle, but I do it in private on night zero. When do you learn the number? So I have oh, control. okay. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, did, nice. Who did you do it on? Um, I don't know if I want to out that just yet. Especially because yeah. of... Yeah. Well, I actually kind of wouldn't mind getting rid of Justin. I think he could be the pit hag. I did have a cannibal in the claim. He's Justin's an a... Oh, like a traveling pit hag, maybe? Is that yeah. yeah. That's my theory. Um, I only told you, Justin, and Alan in my in my three. Um, so you're picking so far, Nathan. You're claiming me and then Alex in that order. Yeah, I thought you were the outsider because you just wanted to die. Yeah, no, that's that's fair. It's nearly gone time. Oh. Too slow. Oh, already? Jeez. Long. That's a fast one. That was quick. Why wow, everyone's just ignoring Rick, the Rick, you owe me a three for three after asking I'm coming, me coming, 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 coming now, coming now. My bad, Amelia. Thank you. There. All right, welcome back, <laughs> okay. everybody. Uh, it's time for nominations and executions. Uh, I just wanted to say, um, based on what I've heard in the past two days, is strong probability of spy game based on my death. Uh, but yeah, either that or I'm a Fengu, I guess, as Alan assuredly pointed out to me. <laughs> no, I, I agree. That's probably why I just got pit hugged. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah, cannibal. Yeah, that's yeah. So and what did you got put hides into a good Yaga bubble? Lunatic. I, I, lunatic, yeah. No, but you, if you're a lunatic you can't think you're good, can you? Um Oh Wait, is that if somebody's well, pit hagged into the lunatic, then they're just shown that they're the demon. But you don't tell them that they're evil now. Uh just to assist with this question, um, I'm gonna read out the lunatic text verbatim. You think you are a demon, but you are not. Oh, okay. I hope that yeah. helps. <laughs> I the phrase one, so we'll see if there's extra kills. <laughs> oh, you might be a real good Jager Bible, actually. Is that what we're saying? Yeah. <laughs> well, the chances Alex, are very Alex, slim. Alex thinks they're a demon, so that, that fulfills the lunatic criteria. Got it. Yeah. yeah but we'll see if there's an extra that. death or how it meant. How, I don't know how many deaths um, there should be. To be honest, I don't matter anymore. I'm irrelevant, so... Oh, Alex, that's not fair. You do. It's okay, guys. I'm just crazy. So let's <laughs> talk about other people um, who are suspicious. Um, Amelia... Oh, no. Uh, Alex was the cannibal, right? Yeah. Yeah, so we'd, we'd had a plan. That was why I was very happy to die. Are you happy to share your role, Amelia? Um... Or, like, ballpark? I was a get-info-once character. Okay. Are nominations open? They sure are. Okay. I'd like to nominate May, please. Alright, Halloweedy has nominated May. Tell us why. Um, I'm a bit sus of their claim. Uh, this is a little bit meta, but 
I've already got a few like you start knowing or like one time info roles. Um and I just think May's claim is the most sus. Okay. May, any rebuttal? Uh I am a time fox and uh so I'm sorry if uh, you don't believe me, <laughs> but uh, I think that will be a, a very wrong decision if you guys want to kill me. Okay, uh, five votes are required to put May onto the block. Spinning it down, starting now. Okay, five is enough. Uh, May has been slated for execution. Any further nominations? Um, to be honest, to me, it feels like it could be spy game. But um, I only, I only told four people. Well, I told Amelia my role yesterday, but Amelia was dead, so it wasn't a surprise probably. Um, and then three other people I had in my twos or threes. That was Nathan, Justin, and Alan. I think as a world, if it's not a spy game, Justin could be the apprentice pit hag. Um, so I wouldn't mind calling for the exile of Justin. All right, I've heard a call for the exile of the Traveler. Reminder, this is a free vote, doesn't cost any dead votes, and it is going to require five. Uh, but um, please uh, tell us why, Alex. Why should we remove Justin from the town? Might be the pit hag. Could also be the spy, um, to be honest. Uh, this was a base one minion game. Uh, I think there's a, a good chance he could be evil, to be honest, in my opinion. Sorry, I thought he Traveler? That's correct. Yeah. Uh, Justin is the apprentice, and when the apprentice gains their ability, they're no longer the traveler token, um, which is a bit messy. It's a client thing, yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. So th um, this is an exile norm, not a normal norm. That's correct. Yeah. Uh, so, Justin, why should we keep you around? Um, I am a good monk, a traveling monk. Um, sorry, I guess it's not the most helpful if you want to get rid of me and solve worlds. But I think it's better off going after actual players in the town that could be demons instead. Or both. And keep my good vote. Two travelers or okay. traveling as well? Uh, um, we have... Uh, all of you and just the travelers. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so uh, five votes are required. Pretty sure. Uh, should be six. Should be There's six. That's players. right. Thank you. Six votes are required. Uh, and I'll be taking the vote starting now. And I think Paul is voting for this because he's the evil traveler and he knows I'm the good traveler. Well, I'm voting for this because we're, if we're meddling this, we're an opposite team. So I believe you're the evil. Okay, um, that I'll is I mean, unfortunately enough. Justin, I'm going to politely but firmly ask you to leave. Uh, I think you need to refund my vote token, Keith. Oh, yes. How do I do that? Oh, Justin did leave. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he really did, He's I guess. His chair's Bye, Justin. Um, Bye, Justin. Cool. Yes, everything looks correct. Any further nominations? Okay, I'll be closing in 10. Yeah, All right, yeah. May has been executed and dies. Everybody, please go to sleep. This is shaping up rather interestingly. Even though we've had an evil ping on the Atlas and we've had Alex publicly say that Nathan is one of the people that would have known about the cannibal. So I think we're going to see a minion created here, but we're going to start with our harlot. Hello. Uh, hey. Please select a living player. Okay. Um, I'd like to select Kate. Okay. I will be right back. Two outsiders. Cool. There's no outsider removal, right? Hello. <laughs> Hello. You've been selected by the harlot. Would you oh. like for them to learn your character? 
Oh, if you kill me, I'm going to be so pissed because there's no, no reason to say no. Except that I want to keep getting info. Um, but also I could take down an evil harlot if they are in fact evil. Um, hmm. I'll say... Yeah. Oh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, sure, why not? Okay. I'm a great man. So there's a world I'm lost to evil now. Um... Dang, that's cursed. Wait, is that how that works? So cursed. Yeah, I asked... Oh, hello. Um, you learned that Kate is the town crier. Okay. All right, thank you very much. You evil. To Maestro and... Okay. Uh, let me have our lunatic. Because they are the Yag Babble, they do not actually need to wake and do anything. How good is that? Uh, then we're going to have our Atlas. Hello. Yes, hello. Uh, so first thing in regards to your question earlier, you yeah. created the outsider, so you know that they're they are I don't the know outsider. What they are, though. That's if correct. their ability is the lunatic, I should know that they're in play. Um that's correct. So you do know that you have a lunatic, um okay. but they're not giving you any information. That's okay. So Alex is the lunatic, is that's that correct, yeah. Yeah, okay. Good. Just checking um, that they're not playing five dimensional chess <laughs> yeah. in that case so please select someone to die first yeah please kill alan okay and turn alex into a minion the same alex the same alex yes interesting okay yeah. okay um cool cool best of luck that's what i thought at first but i, I thought i'd double check hello Hello. You thought you were cooked before. It okay. just gets weirder now. Um, you've been selected by Atlas. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> you are now a minion. You are the evil pit hag. What the f Nathan <laughs> is your <What>? Atlas. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why <laughs> get away from me? <laughs> um, the night order normally dictates that the pit hag goes before the demon, but in this scenario, I will allow you to activate. Oh my god! Okay, so sorry. sorry. <laughs> Do they have to be a an out of character? The pit hag creating character? that's correct. Even if they're dead, so that means in every world here, Justin would have had been the pit hag. I guess. Okay. Um, wait, so, wait, so there couldn't have been another pit hag in the game. The apprentice has the ability of a character. Okay. But I got, I have to have, sorry. I'm a bit... Is sorry. it the lunatic thing that you're confused about? No, no. I, I was just wondering, so for me to have been changed to the pit hag now. Yes. Does that mean I have to have had, like, there couldn't have been another pit hag? No. Oh, okay. Atlas, Atlas doesn't specify not in play, but Atlas removes oh. all outsiders and minions, so there just wouldn't be one. And That's the Apprentice okay. isn't an in-play pit hag. The Apprentice just has an ability of a townsfolk or a minion. Oh my god. Do, so do I learn my demon? Yeah, or it's this? Nathan. It's Nathan? Oh, yeah. Of course it, that makes sense. That's why he, I got here. Okay, cool. Um, I don't learn my minions? You're it. <laughs> oh, I'm one minion. Oh yeah, of course. Oh, okay. Okay, <laughs> sorry, I'm crazy. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, um, cool. And sorry, that means there's only been one outside of me, if that's true. That's, as okay. far as I understand it, correct. Cool, okay. Um, I'm going to change... Sorry, I didn't expect this at all. Um, could I change Weedy into the Stalker? Sure. Cool, thank you. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> so, so if we're running with this world that I'm the spy, all of you should be happy to... Hello. 
You've Why been you? selected by the pet hag. You are now the stalker. Right. Um, quick clarification. So that means, it, are you explicitly saying it was the pit hag and not like an Atlas ability? You have specifically been selected by the pit hag. The chosen one. I wasn't even bluffing anything useful. Okay. So at the start of the game. So obviously that part's not going to do anything. Okay. So if um, the demon is ever state of execution and does not die, you become evil. That's it. Okay. Cool. So stop lifts, basically. Well, try and try and lift off the demon. Ah, uh, lift off the demon and become evil, yeah. or stop lifts and stay good. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Sounds good. Uh, good luck with it. Um, this will be easy. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, I'm showing people that they are pit hagged specifically because way back in the day. It used to be, uh, this character selected you, Pit Hag, you are now character. I don't know if that's changed or not. That's just how I like doing it. And especially because it's going to marry up with the lunatic narrative that I set up earlier, I think it works nicely. Um, I need to check who nominated yesterday. We did, in fact, get a call for exile. So there's going to be a no on the town crier. Hello. Hello. You learned that no minion nominated. Yeah, that checks out. Um, two quick questions. Sure. Um, the harlot death, if it was going to happen, can that happen at any time? Um, I believe it happens at the beginning of the night. Okay. And um, I presume that the you in the Atlas ability is you, the storyteller, from the characters you removed from play, etc. Uh, the Atlas removes the character. And then when the Atlas adds characters back, those oh. are the characters that it adds from. So it would be base two outsiders and then minions would be, so you would put minions in the bag and then take them out. Uh, I set up basically as if there is no minions or outsiders, but I, I have in my head who I want to be those things. Right, so they they would only have the choice of two of the four minions. Basically. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Thank you. Looks like Scott. Okay, and then our last one is going to be our final village idiot. Hello. Hello. Uh, please Am I select still a alive? Player. Yeah. I can't believe that. That's insane. Uh, can I check uh, Amelia? Amelia. You learned that Amelia is good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Last round of checks because some things happen. Uh, is the reward a lunatic marionette will think they're a minion? Uh, no. Alex is paranoid. Uh, that's fine. That's what I want, I guess. Uh, okay, so this has happened, this has happened, this has happened, everything's kind of happened. Let's wake everybody up. Actually, Hello, really everybody. Cool. Good morning. Oh, no, you yeah. wake to discover Alan has died. Um, this is our, we have five non-travelers alive. So it's not quite the end just yet, uh, but we will have three minutes for today. See you all in three minutes. Okay. Okay. Are we still concerned about a normal spy game? Not a spy game, but like a, just a normal. Uh, I'm concerned that you got your fellow travel travel out immediately after you join the game. Kids, though, right? That's that's like their job title. Pretty much. Um, I. Um. Hmm. Uh, I'm a village idiot. Um, oh, yeah, I heard that. Yeah, but I... <sighs> okay, no, I'm not. I'm actually the town crier. Oh. Um, but um, I don't have any... I don't have much useful info, I guess. Other than that, you're not a minion, but you could be the demon. Not a minion. Okay, cool. Um... 
but I did get a good on you. Yo. Do you have any Six questions about me. what's going on so far? Hmm. Um, so just a re quick recap. Yeah. Nathan's the Atlas. That's right. He turned Alex into the pit hag. Uh, he first he... turned Alex into the lunatic. Uh, uh, and then I work Alex and said that he's been pit hagged into being the good Yagababble. And then the following nice. night, Alex turned him into the pit hag. But the Atlas no. doesn't choose. He just said minion. And then I was like, well, there's this noise. There's a pit hag in play already. So. Makes sense. Makes sense. Lovely. Um, are you allowed to specify? Uh, I assume the Atlas are, does not. Right. In theory, you set a, a rack up and you remove the characters that are going to be balanced for that rack up and then replace them with Townsfolk. And then Atlas just adds them back over time. Uh, so they become a character type. Okay. But you don't get to choose the type. Yeah. Very cool. So he goes, okay, that person becomes a minion. And I go, yep, this was the pit hag I had planned on all along. Nice. And then Weedy as an outsider. He became the stalker. Um, the pit hag created the stalker. Very nice. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So Nathan, even if he picks the same person to change characters, he'll still run out of... That's right. He only has one outsider creation remaining. Mm, okay and one minion creation or no minion? no it's a nine default so one minion two outsiders okay i see we just had a bunch of travelers what was um alex before the was... cannibal oof okay yeah Big swing yeah um is paul good or evil uh, paul is the evil harlot makes sense and justin's the the, the apprentice guy. monk nice okay spicy all right well that's, that's pretty I much everything they might pull it out but uh we'll see i guess yeah i think it's slowly heading away from the uh good i mean good starts off with a big advantage uh, and we have a village idiot that's seen the demon hello hello i want to double check something yep. if i turn if i choose to turn alex into the i have to pick a player to turn into an outsider right that's correct it's one outsider if i choose yeah, to turn one, alex yeah. will alex remain on my team no, he will become a good outsider. Really? That's right. Oh, okay. All right, thanks. All good. If it is a Atlas, hello everyone. Probably a minion being made now. Welcome back to the town square. It is once again time for nominations and executions. Uh, Rick, I see a hand. That's that's my hand. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to nominate Nathan. Rick nominates Nathan. Rick, tell us why. Well, I can use that good old line, I haven't spoken to you yet, but I'm a village idiot. I checked Justin first night got good. I checked you second night got evil. And I checked Amelia last night and got good. I don't know if that's enough to confirm I'm not drunk. I don't know but I feel like you could be on the evil side. All right, sure. Nathan. Well, yes, a drunk village idiot does eventually have to get someone in their pings of evil, right? So uh, I would buy into that world. I do think Amelia is most certainly good. Not totally sure about Justin, but I have told Justin my role um, and two other players have my info i'd rather not die i'd like to make sense of the info i received last night but uh yeah didn't get a chance today that's all okay uh three votes are required going to be starting the countdown now no okay this is probably a worthwhile was it that vote oh there's only three votes required all right, three is enough. Nathan is slated for execution. Any further nominations? Um, I'll nominate Kate. So, all right, Alex has nominated Kate. Please tell us why. I wish I got to speak to Kate earlier in the game. <laughs> I've heard of Belina's information. That was night one, Amelia. Night two, me. Night three, Kate. Um, night to me makes sense because I was turned into the lunatic, so I was an outsider. That means Kate is either townsfolk, minion, or demon, um, and not an outsider. Um, I think 
I, I was wondering as well concerning my sorry this is a bit of a tangent if it was an atlas game would you say that i got kit hyped night two is that are you asking me yeah <laughs> Um, the pit hag activating tells its victim that it's being pit hagged. The atlas does not. Oh, okay. That's well, not I got right. So that means okay. With the pit hag activating, what? Sorry. The pit hag activating the classic the the one million years ago when this game first started on the back of a rock. It would go. This character has selected you, and you would show the pit hag card, and then it would say you are. And then you would show what their new character is, and then you would indicate with a thumb up or a thumb down based on any alignment changes, if necessary. Are you running it that way? That is how I run the pit hag, yes. Oh, that's not how the pit hag is run these days. Because you don't know whether or not you're being pit hagged or barber swapped in an SMB game. But anyway, yeah. good to know. So, Alex, well, you're specifically claiming to have been pit hagged. Yeah, I was pit hagged both nights too. So, was anyone pit hagged last night? It might have been turned into a junk or a stalker. Well, this is yeah, something I'm worried about. about. Say if he got Alice. I'm worried about it's someone having been turned into a junk. Uh, we are waffling a little bit. Did you have any last things to add? Okay, Kate, oh. would you please tell us why we should keep you alive? That's a strong defense. It's mm. kind of hard to beat. Kind of iron clad. Uh, should we wait? Um, Kate should has said. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's, let's wait. Um, do we want to do other nominations first, maybe? If is there. Yeah, can I call for exile? Yes, we can do an exile vote. Justin, would you like to call for exile? Yes. All right, I'm assuming it's on Paul and not yourself. Um, yes. <laughs> All right, Justin, tell us why we should exile Paul. Because he joined the game and immediately voted to exile me. And also, if I'm good, he's evil. And an evil player would do that. Okay. I'm good, and I know that you're evil. If I'm bettering this, I know that you're evil. So I wanted to exile you because of that. Um, I will say that I've received uh, information to potentially confirm Kate. Um, she could still be the spy. Um, but yeah, if we're if we're worried about her being the spy, then she could. Uh, it, there's a world in which she could be. Um, so why don't you come out with that when Alex nominated Kate? Uh, well, no, there was not enough, like hardly any votes at all on her. So there's there was no reason to. Um, now, kind of want to keep her um, role semi hidden. I'm not gonna like reveal it. But I just want to say that she's confirmed uh, for me at least. Who'd you check on Unless that too? Spy. Oh, Kate. Wait, night two or night three? Well, the night that just went by, I... The harlot has activated I exactly joined. once. Oh, yeah. okay. I joined after, um, on night two, actually. Once is enough. Yeah. Okay, yeah, at least it. he got to All three right. days of really... To reiterate, this is a free oh, vote. Okay, if you spend a dead vote, I will reshuffle you, I suppose. I can be generous. But six votes is required. Uh, so I'm going to be starting the countdown now. Okay. Paul, you have been exiled. Politely remove thyself from town. Um, now, do we want to return? I believe... Kate is back. Um, yep. Did you want to say anything, Alex, before you go to Kate's defense? Um, if Paul is the evil harlot, Kate might also just be evil. <laughs> so. Okay, Kate, it's time. We've been waiting. We want to know Sorry, why guys. we should keep you alive. <clears throat> uh, I'm not evil. Um, if Paul is the evil harlot, Paul at the very least told the truth about my role and only Paul and one other person know what my role is. Um, it wouldn't be great to execute me, but I have some info, so it wouldn't be the end of the world, I guess. Okay. 
Uh, three to tie, four to die, spinning it down, starting now. Okay, that is not enough. Final call for nominations. Um, yeah, I'll nominate Rick. All right, Nathan nominates Rick. Nathan, please tell us why. Well, I'd rather not die. I'd like to get one more Night of Info. I'm sure that's the same defense that Rick is going to say as well, but <laughs> I do think Kate was probably better kill here based on the Balloonist info. But um, yeah, I don't know. I guess it's only fair to nominate Rick back. Uh, Rick, any regards? Nathan is correct. It is fair to nominate back. Uh, I would suggest you stick with this uh, Nathan on the block, and if people feel so inclined, uh, feel free to kill me tomorrow. Okay. Uh, three to tie, four to die. Spinning it down, starting now. Oh, we wow. Go. Oh, that's concerning. Here we go. Perfect. That was a lift. Hey, this is the last wow. one. All right, that is a wow. tie. No one is currently slated for wow. execution. I think Not we should Alex sound the please. evil team. So is Paul and Alex, sorry, Paul and Kate on the same team or what? Who has a nominated today? Um, the people um, who can still nominate are Kate. That is and it. Has anyone from this Yeah, Alex, uh, Weedy, Alex and Weedy. Yeah, someone could nominate Alex. That would be good. Kate, yeah. someone do the honors. Uh, Kate nominates Alex. All right, Kate nominates Alex. Kate, please tell us why. Uh, I don't know. I haven't heard anything in town. I mean, I don't know about this whole story. It makes sense for me, um, based on the last three minutes of information, <laughs> that um, if the balloonist info was Amelia, then. Alex then me that makes sense if Alex been Alex has been pit hagged into a lunatic um would Alex just a quick storyteller question um would Alex still count as a demon for balloonist if oh I'm so confused about how that interacts it, with that. Balloonist no, that... is an outsider yeah. so if the balloonist saw no, a, a a lunatic they would be registering as an outsider but if Alex was pit hagged, for example, pit hagged into the night order? or whatever, are we? Uh, are we settled oh, on well, this info comes after, I Wait, believe. I guess the, I think the question here is like: so, if, for example, a balloonist learnt a mm. uh, learnt Alex as a townsfolk on day one, then on night two, Alex is pit hagged into a non or changes from a townsfolk to say another character. Would the next character and the balloonist info? be not a townsfolk or not the new character that Alex has become? Great question. Um, when the balloonist activates, it says, hey, what was the last thing I saw? Um, so if that character has changed, when it checks the next night that it would activate, it goes back and says, well, hey, that thing was the pit hag or whatever. This thing was a minion. This thing was a lunatic. It's then going to use that to check against the next thing. Yeah, so it would use the Pit, Alex's pit hagged a new character as a reference point yeah. for the next night in that world. Also, I'm happy to just clarify because the balloonist info is coming from me and it's going to come out tomorrow anyway. Um, the order that I got it was Amelia, then night two, Alex, and then night three, Kate. So Amelia has never changed. I assumed Amelia was the outsider trying to get herself killed. But Apparently that's not the case. I, I don't want to out Amelia's role. Exactly. I don't even know what it is, but uh, she's not claiming out. Alex, I would love to hear from you. Did you have anything you wanted to add to this nomination? I actually think it's just my story, and that I might be a marionette. Just, <laughs> I just think Nathan's my demon, but I don't actually know. <laughs> explain, the, explain that vote, Alex, um, last not... minute. That's what I want to know. Yeah. Yeah, because I think I'm the marionette, and I think I was about to do it, to be honest. Or um, Nathan was the demon and you didn't want him. <laughs> I, I have a feeling, yeah, because I don't think it's an Alice game because I got pit-hugged, uh, specifically. Um, I could actually still be a good person. 
Um, <laughs> how do I let's explain just, that? Just... All right, three to tie, four to die. Spinning it down, starting oh, like, now. Used it, yeah, yeah I'm gonna, gonna, use it, it. I'm gonna it. drop. I'm gonna drop. I think no matter what, we have to kill Alex. I'll use my vote so you don't have to. Thank you. Yeah, I think oh, I had to drop there because no matter what, I saw Weedy dropping. Tie. Why did we? Ooh, vote? no one. Weedy we, Weedy's evil. executed. Weedy's just Ooh, evil. That's spicy. I'll nominate okay. myself. Weedy nominates thyself. Wait, who was that on? It was tied. So it was okay. on you, Nathan. The only remaining nomination. On... <laughs> who was the last nominee? Who was the last nominee? Hang on, I want to hear this. I want to hear what he's got to say. We're on five. Uh, yeah. I'm so confused. I think, I think Nathan is the demon. I'm the one who got pit hagged last night. I got pit hagged into the stalker. And so I clarified with Keith ignore the first half of the text. But if the demon is ever slated for execution, does not die, I would become evil. Uh... I think we had Nathan on the block. Yep. And oh, so, so you're worried now, about if we kill me, then I don't turn evil, and I can win with good. Good, yeah. Because oh, I was going to find it quite hard to win with evil, which is why yeah. I dropped, because I would rather die. Wait, wait. So, it makes sense. So Slater right. for execution is... that on? Right. Were we voting on... Rick? Oh, wait, were we still voting on Rick just then? No, no, that was a vote on Alex. Which Alex? Alex. The one... Alex. I'm waiting. at 6 o'clock. Oh, I thought we were voting... I... Wait, wait, uh, so all right, three to tie, four to die, spinning it down, starting we now. Last night. Was that yeah, we tagged last night. Been, couldn't have been the pit we did that bit here, unfortunately. Yeah, it, it, it was a pit hag, as Keith clarified. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. That, okay. I'm not sure I agree with uh, that. Sorry. Was, here's... Alex, was Alex on the block or no? No, 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 no. no one was on the block. Nathan was the third was time. The block, but it got lifted. So, yeah, that I can't be... every nomination has been exhausted. Weedy, who is currently slated, will be executed. Everyone, please go to sleep. You can squabble with your damn eyes closed. Mm. <laughs> All right, a lot of shit is going on. Uh, and Weedy has the read correct. As you can see by the night sheet, the stalker would turn evil at the beginning of the night. Hey, Chief. Hello. Um, not sure how to like join you for conversations, but I feel like that would be fun. So, um, we should be able to just invite people to this voice chat. So uh, I'll just try and do that. Yes. Um, starting with our pit hag. Mm. Hello. <laughs> um, what fun. would you like to do? Oh, I hate being pit hag and sitting with okay. <laughs> um, so my idea here. Well, you have to do something to try and stop your team from losing, probably. Uh, yeah. And multiple people out loud said <laughs> who the demon was. I know. So I was thinking of marry of putting myself into a demon, or I could claim to everyone that I just got turned into the demon for real. You could do something very funny. Yeah. I don't know right. if I could say. I don't want to. I don't want to interfere. But trying not to help. <laughs> Yeah, the issue is that everyone's going to know, because one of the demons have to die, right, pretty much, because mm -hmm. it says final, three, final three. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I don't know what to do regarding that. I, I think it's, like, my only The demon doesn't have to do... be good and evil. Sorry, what did you say? Oh, I was just going to say that the demon doesn't have to be evil. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I was also thinking mm. of... <laughs> um, but question though, the imitator Weedy would be good because he's dead and the ability doesn't work. Sorry, the stalker. Yes, that's correct. Um, the very, very first thing on the night sheet is the stalker turning evil if the conditions were met. Okay, cool. Okay, that's good to know. Um, if I turn someone to the marionette, they say it, they say good. Yeah, that's right. The pit hag does okay. not change alignments. No, no, it's not good. Okay. I have two really funny choices here, and it really depends on who Nathan kills, and I don't know who Nathan's going to kill. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, I'm going to change. Oh, wait, all outsiders are marionettes. If I turn someone into the maestro. Um, so, how many? There's only Weedy. How many votes are there left? There's Roller. Uh, 
Nathan. The mm. maestro's square brackets is a setup thing. If you create oh. a maestro, nothing will happen to the state of the board. All right, that's fine. Um, oh, this is hard. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> I'm lost in what to do. Okay, I'm going to change. Oh, this is. If I change someone to the Fengu, but there's no there's nothing else happens. Okay. Um, also, the Fengu won't attack. Deaths will be arbitrary. Oh, yeah, that's true. Good point. I don't think it really matters. I think it'd be funny if I do a... Whatever. I'll change um, Rick into the Fengu. Okay. Yeah. Because Rick will be the hardest to believe. And I'm going to change. say I got changed into the Maestro. Nice <laughs> Makes sense. Bye. All right, good luck. Ah, uh, please leave. We're stuck in a group chat. <laughs> Ooh, spicy. I like that play. It's something. Mm. Problem is... Hello, Rick. Hello. You have been selected by the Pit Hag. I thought so. You have been turned into the Fangu. Oh, fuck me. Your alignment has not changed. And my alignment has not changed. That's correct. Okay, thank you. Ah, uh, there we go. Um, so the other <laughs> thing is that good. the time of the deaths at the pit hag means that the atlas will not activate. Do they? Oh, because you have to kill before. Yeah. But would you still let the atlas pick? Probably not. Fair if enough. anything, I mean, atlas could just undo what the pit hag has done, <laughs> either by killing yeah. or by changing to an outsider. I think that's more balanced. Yeah. All right, so we just get our town cry out, and then that's it. Nice. Hello. Hello. You are going to be shocked to learn that a minion did, in fact, nominate yesterday. Shut the front door. I know, right? Get crazy. out of town. <laughs> I can't believe I'm still alive. I think I'm going to be a frame. That's fun. All right. Fuck. Thanks. Uh, that's it. That's everyone. Mm, it's tricky because it's not obvious that there's been a pit hack change if only nathan dies but well if everyone's really confident nathan's the demon and they go well okay then who was pit hanged yeah and they have to believe rick who's like well i'm the good demon you have to kill me to win <laughs> yeah yeah and you can't just leave both alive because then yeah. yeah all right let's see how it goes that's true hard. Yeah. that means justin couldn't have been good um, morning everybody you awake to discover Nathan has died. Welcome to the final Whoa. day. There will be no private chats. You will have three minutes for discussion, and then we will have nominations and executions. Um, I just got to hack into the maestro as well, by the way. <laughs> so, into the into the maestro. Into the maestro, yeah. <laughs> it just um, so so Nathan I just died, and so I think I'm... Have... That oh, makes I'm me have to... What? Dag just got pit hagged. Or... Hey Keith, if um if someone's pit hagged into the lunatic, do they find out that they're the lunatic or that they're a demon? Um, the lunatic's ability says that I have to do anything in my power to convince them that they are a demon. Right. So Alex theoretically could be pit hagged into a lunatic. That's correct. I was already. I'm already the lunatic. Uh, Can you please share your info from us? Yeah. Time? Yeah, I'll share my info. <laughs> Uh, I am a Fangu, and I am good. That's slow uh, enough. And at what point are you claiming yeah. that you became a Fangu? Last night. Uh, so I wanted, to, yeah. I wanted to hear what Alex came out with. <laughs> I'm calling bullshit on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I kind of feel that time. Alex has turned into a minion on the night two, and then claimed to be made the lunatic. So is it just Kate then? No, I think it's actually Rick. I think Rick what? is just the only good demon. I think, oh, I think Nathan was an evil right. demon who's been killed through the pit hag. Oh, and Rick awesome. is now the good demon and the only demon. Um, so only one in, death? In the night, Rick, what happened with you? Sorry. I was told I was pit hagged. So uh, uh, Keith said you've been pit hagged uh, into the Fangu. And I'm a good Fangu. 
And then what ha did you choose yeah, a player or no nothing else? Okay. Could you still be a lunatic though? It, it it's it if Rick is a lunatic. You didn't get to choose a player. It's That's kind of a 50 50, player. right? So Alex could be lying. If Alex is lying and was ne never turned into the lunatic, then Rick could have turned into the lunatic last night via Pit Hag. There's other options where Alex, uh, like for example, Kate could be the pit hag who pit hagged Rick into the lunatic, sorry, into the Fangu, and then Nathan died in the night because he was the other demon. So Rick could legitimately be a good Fangu, but he could also be a good player who thinks they're the Fangu because they're the lunatic. Could and Rick Alex also just be a minion now? The demon. Wait, another... If it's an Atlas, could Rick just be a minion now? Oh no, no, no. I think... you know that there was a, a, a pit hag before. So I think Rick is genuinely good. Um, so I'm, if I'm also a village idiot, I believe I am the drunk one. Um, on the first night I got Rick is evil. Um, the second night I got Rollo is evil and then Rollo died. I believe I'm just the drunk village idiot. And I was you should nominate yourself. Who's the third village idiot? Is there a world that I got turned into the lunatic? Like, and uh, nominations or... are open. Yeah, There's but a... you would have to... Oh, where uh... someone got... Oh, that actually, you know, there's a weird... Girl. Afterwards, Chris, did and you then get they turned me back into the lunatic. You can be turned into a lunatic, then into the actual demon, and then back into a lunatic. Can a pit hag operate twice in a night? <laughs> pit hag only operates no, once. Not with, then, not with what's the problem between here. my yeah, story and Alex's but... story. That's it. I'm really. The, the, there is... I'll vote on Rick. Alex, Atlas is pit hag or not? For... I I just thought I was changed last night. By a pit hag, as Key said, he has no, a pit hag. Yeah, they didn't say pit hag. No. Okay, so maybe via Atlas. Uh, the storyteller at this time would choose to recognise Kate's hand raised. Um. So, I don't. It, to me, either Rick is either the good demon currently, or he is specifically uh, a minion that was pit hagged into the demon therefore killing nathan the demon um but like pit he was self pit hagged if that makes sense can you do that that's correct you can select any player yeah. um and the reason i say that is because i am the town crier on day one alan alex and weedy nominated and i got a no on day two only weedy nominated and i got a no and on day three everybody nominated and of course i got a yes and so pointing to that either nathan or rick is the minion and therefore only those two could be the pit hag and so therefore i think rick is simply the evil demon currently or the good demon and we should kill rick regardless that's all thank you agreed uh excellent uh justin you have a hand also um yeah, I'll let you guys figure it out, but I just want to say what I observed, which was if you guys believe I'm good and if we believe the meta that the other trouble is evil, I saw Paul talking to Rick first for a very long time after joining the game. That's all. Okay, Paul. Um, I just want to ask Alan, so you're claiming village idiots, so wouldn't that mean that they're, if you and Rick are village idiots, wouldn't that mean there's a third village idiot because there were two extras? Um, so yes, there are three village idiots. Third. Um, like two, they can they can out their info if they want, but they got a good on me on night one and then died after that. Does the other village idiot want to come out? Because I know that Kate was claiming village idiot, but that was a. a I was claiming that. And she, I, mean, I actually saw her as the town crier in my holotech, so I know that she's not the village idiot, or at least she might be the spy, but probably not. So, so yeah, you and Kate are on the same team, but why? Your voting yesterday was pretty sus. No, we're not necessarily on the same team. Um, oh. It could just be the evil harlot who's telling the truth, but he did tell the truth about my role. Oh, well, as in, I shared a three that included my real role, and Paul was happy with that. I didn't actually yeah. explicitly say I was the town crier. I'm yeah. really happy about it. But I just want to find Makes out like, who's the third village idiot if they want to come out. It's like the final day it will be useful. There doesn't have to be three. It's me. Doesn't have I'm to a third be. village idiot. It's not important. I saw okay. Alan on the first day as good, and then I died in the night. Okay. Thanks. All right, Amelia. Um, May, I was just wondering, you said you had first day info. I still haven't heard it. Or well, someone said you had. Um, are you willing to share? For, uh, you're talking to me. Yeah. They say, oh, in fact, no, I don't. Ha I don't know who said this. I have first day info because, I, in fact, is I don't have 
info until the final day. The night before the final day, I'm the monk says cracker. Uh, okay. Yeah, May bluffs Shigenja to me, which is why I, I thought she had first day info. Because gotcha. I can't tell okay. everyone who I am at that stage. <clears throat> All right, I would like to hear a nomination. Oh, never mind. I, I won't go through my role, it's too complicated. Um, I'll nominate myself. Okay. Uh, tell us why you've done this. So, I think there's a world where I could be a marionette. Um, I'm just doing this to take the floor. Um, I think I'm still a good kill, but I wasn't told that I was Pete Hags last night. I was just told that I got changed, unless I didn't hear it properly. Um, Do you want to check with the storyteller we... now, whether you heard that properly, Alex? Because it's rather important. I don't, well, they can't say it publicly. Not publicly, but it's, can you do a... But there couldn't have been another... Silent cold so. Is there any... Yeah, I can see it. Sorry, tell Yeah, I can, I can ask. Um, no, it's I rather can... important. It's your accusation. <laughs> How do I invite you? Can I add pertinent, please? I have to close it for you to do that. Alex um, would not have pit hacked himself if my info is true because on day one, I got a no on Alex, Weedy, and Alan. Hello. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I guess I, I, oh, I was pit hacked. Okay. That's weird. Okay. No mind. But the, like, uh, no, I don't know. Like, if it's a hey, can't be a starting drum. I misheard. I did get changed by Pit Hag. You have... saying you were Pit Hag? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, sorry. I must have misheard. Yeah. I think no. I'm voting for you then. No. I mean, I'm, I'm happy to die here as well. Um, I think I'm the better kill. Um, this doesn't make any sense. Because I, I was trained last night. <laughs> so, I don't know. Okay. Two votes is required gonna be spinning it down starting now so nothing from nathan nothing from justin nothing from paul well, well paul's used this before paul's used this dead vote so oh yeah no I'm that not. is four votes alex is slated for execution i thought alex was gonna drop his hand i thought he too no i think i think it's rick like i think rick is good but i think rick is just a good demon or, or alex is committing to the fake out nominates rick all right kate musically nominates rick please sing your accusations now i refuse um very well i appreciate that uh, i mean i already said all of my information alex can't be starting pit hag if my info is true i have to believe my info is true because the worlds we're living in is um, either Atlas or Maestro, either of which means that the outsiders are zero. Is that not right? Like, so I couldn't have been the drunk. At the very least on night one, I couldn't be. And so, well, not night one, night two, but I don't know. I All my info points to either Rick being evil or Rick being a good demon. So I think this is the this is the go. I don't know, whatever. Nathan, right. don't vote, we win. Rick, we win. is this the go? What? Yeah, see, Nathan... Uh, we win. There you go. So Good just opinion. to just to yeah. uh, deal with Kate's accusations, uh, she thinks I might be a good demon. Yes, I am. I've I've come out with that and shared it with the town. If um, you believe that, then you should vote for yourself. How do I know there's not a good demon and an evil demon? Because you, there, you that would be an unwinnable situation, and I I think the ST wouldn't do that. If they if there were two demons, the game would already be over. Okay, well in that case then I shall vote, if, if we're saying that, then I shall vote for myself, vote for me. I'm surprised that, Na I'm pretty sure we had Nathan on the block the other day and he did not vote on that one on Alex, so I'm surprised. Yeah. Yeah, because he didn't want Alex to die and so Alex Yeah, to so evil. again... It no, is, to, be, uh, to be honest, I actually had the wrong Alex when I voted. I thought we were voting for now. a wee got the wrong block. Alex twice now. Only once. Right. Four to die, okay. five to die. Spinning it down, starting now. We've already lost anyway. Are if we? you vote Weedy, then Alex can break whatever we got. Alex, vote on this. No. Yeah. That's no we already that Kate, Kate, Kate will be the demon. Not here. enough. And that is going to signal the end of the game as there's not enough votes remaining for it to be beaten. Alex has been executed, and the game has ended. Now, I'm going to go and do the whole grimoire reveal. This is a really cooked game. 
So please bear with me while I run through everything. Uh, let me let me first press the button, um, press which the is um, which that is one. here somewhere. Um, is everyone just on the evil team? I feel like everyone's just on the evil team. It's a Legion game. As far as I know. <laughs> a Legion I, game? I feel like I'm pushing shit up. I was so sure Alex was just doing the most All right. play. Let me run through the Grimoire reveal. Now, let's start with some easy things. Let's start with our travelers. First, we had Paul, who is our evil harlot. Oh, that amazing. only got to activate on one player, which was Kate. Uh, we'll come back to that later. Uh, then we had our apprentice, Justin, who was the monk. Uh, I was actually really looking forward to the monk doing some cool shit here, but he was removed very quickly. We then have our, uh, our psionic, which at the start of the game picked... Uh, Weedy, Alan, Rollo, and Justin, and then in that order, ascending from townsfolk outside at Minion Demon, and learnt that one of them was correct. Uh, which, in the setup, well, was kind of funny. Uh, which you'll see in a second, anyway. Um, we then have Rollo, our starting village idiot, uh, who got correct information you know, to the one time. Uh, Alan, who was our drunk village idiot, and of course, knowing that you were going to select Rick immediately, I had to make sure that you were going to see evil. Um, then we had May, our mod safe cracker, who did not have the opportunity to activate because they were executed. They didn't have the uh, ability to proc at night either because they were never targeted by the demon. Uh, then this is where things start being a little bit more cooked. Uh, I'm going to reveal that Nathan was the starting Atlas. Surprise. So there was no outsiders or minions at the beginning of the game. Um, our first activation of the Atlas was on Alex, where Alex was turned into an outsider and became the lunatic. And with the lunatic ability... I did everything in my power to convince Alex that they were a good Jagababble, including instructing them that a pit hag was responsible for this change, when in fact there was no pit hag in play. This was then confirmed the following night when the Atlas selected Alex an additional time to turn them into a minion, where they became the pit hag, <laughs> which as you can imagine was very confusing. Um, and then on that night, when uh, Alex became the pit hag, they selected Weedy to become the stalker. Now, now Weedy was slated to become evil, but the very the very first part of the night sheet is the stalker becomes evil. But then you lifted onto yourself so that you could get executed and stay good. So you did in fact stay good. Uh, we then have Kate, our town crier, who got correct information every single day which means that we did in fact have the good Fang Gu Rick at the end of the game who needed to be executed for the good team to win. And that was fighting the fog. This is trying to be the same kind of um, difficulty level as Sex and Violence. And you can see where some of that, that crazy stuff kind of did come in. Um, and I was worried that the Atlas was going to die really early because we did in fact have a village idiot ping on them as evil. Uh, and then in the middle of the game, we had two different people say out loud that they were confident that Nathan was the demon. Uh, so this route was really the only way that Evil had to win the game. But uh, that's, that's um, a good job. Alex should have acted on night three. Alex shouldn't have acted on night three, right? Um, it depends. So the night order normally says that the pit hag is supposed to happen before the demon. Um, but with the way that the Atlas works, I was like, well, I would rather give the Pit Hag an activation. Um, oh. One of the things that Stephen Medway has said before is that the way that the Night Order works is not by law, it's by blocks. Uh, so if you need to move things around for fun or to make things more balanced, then then kind of go for it. 
Uh, and in this case, I was like, yeah, that's, I feel like the pit hag should do something here because I believe that the evil team is literally doing, <laughs> doing rather bad um, with the Atlas not having any real teammates. Uh, and the other thing with the way that I ran the, the pit hag is the classic pit hag, because that's how I've always done it. And I wanted to differentiate between Atlas and the pit hag for when a person becomes a minion. And especially in this situation where the lunatic thought they had been pit hagged, but were not. So hopefully make it less confusing. I don't know uh, if that helped or not. <laughs> also, I was thinking of if, if, if I didn't, if I actually got woken up, I was thinking of turning Alex back into a good outsider, which I could have done and just losing on my own. Yeah, you would just lose immediately because <laughs> the Atlas was... specifies the alignment matches the, the yeah, token type. Yeah, but I didn't want to drag it. If I couldn't lift up the game, I didn't want to drag Alex down <laughs> with me. So yeah. I was like, <laughs> but then I didn't wake up because I had died. That lift was so obvious. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I found out Paul's a 